Hey, and welcome to this week's video. So, this is actually gonna be so exciting. I've done a parcel swap with Kathy from a Kathy moment. Um, obviously, I'll leave all her details below her channel in the end card and everything. But I am so excited because, first of all, I love Kathy. We've met on met on YouTube like. I don't know, years ago, I want to say? Yeah, it was years ago. Um, and always been in touch on like Twitter and Instagram and everywhere. And it's just, yeah, she lives in the US, I live in Switzerland. So it didn't seem like we were going to connect like really anytime soon. But then we came up with this idea to do a tea parcel swap. Because her channel features a lot of tea related um, videos. So yeah. We've decided to do this and send each other a collection of just teas that we think the other person would love. Um, teas that we love and really want the other person to try, I think. Just some samples, or that's what I did. Um, and some like bigger packages, um, stuff like that. Um, I also sent her some stuff from Switzerland, so you guys can see that over on her channel. Um, but yeah, obviously after you watch this video, please go over and immediately watch the counterpart to this um, and see her unbox my parcel because it's, I think it's just so funny. Um, and I'm really, really excited to see her unbox mine and see what she thinks of everything. Like that's like one of the best parts, right? About giving someone like a parcel is see their reaction. So I'm glad that I'll get to see this um, on camera. I just see it says open on this side. So I'll do that. Oh my god, and she used a parcel. She used a parcel from Harvey and Sons, or a box I guess. Which is a tea company if you didn't know. That's so cool! Oh my god! Let's get started. Did I say everything? I feel like I'm so excited I hardly said what I wanted to say. Um, but yeah, we sent each other tea. I'm gonna open this. If you want any like tasting videos of any of the tea that I'm about to unbox right now let me know in the comments which you're most interested in and maybe I'll do like one or two um, but yeah this is gonna be super interesting because I featured some tea that you can only get in my country or in Europe and I would imagine it's probably the same the other way around so oh my god I feel like it's Christmas all over again. Just with tea, tea Christmas. Teamers! Oh my god. Here we go with the annoying pond. Okay, so it looks like this so far. I spy a few things already. Let's take out some of the packaging. I totally could have made an ASMR video out of this. But I'm not going. Oh my god! She, oh, this already looks so nice. She, she wrote me a little card. Let me see if this is for your ears too or just for mine. Her handwriting is so beautiful. So we're gonna stop talking about you in third person now. Yes! Oh, P.S. We should still meet in person someday. Yes, we should. We definitely have to. Oh, we need to make this happen. We need to go to like a tea festival or something. That would be rad. Okay, then there's like white and green tissue paper. Beautiful. Oh my, oh my god. Okay, see the thing is, I feel like because at some point she said, let's make this a challenge. I now feel like already I'm losing and I'm now kind of constantly comparing our two parcels. <sighs> wow. Okay, what should I pick first? I don't know. And all of her notes that she left on the teas are so cute. Okay, hold on. <gasps> okay, this is one from the Bluebird Tea Company, which I've heard a lot about and I've tasted a few of their teas, I think, but I never really owned like tea from them. So this is the Bonfire Toffee Tea. Smoky black tea with caramel and apple. Oh my god. She says This is the culprit behind my tea obsession. I first had this tea after my trip to Brighton in November 2014 And it is still my favorite tea to this day Oh my god, I'm so excited to try this Ooh, For your Roy Bosch obsession she says 
or I never know how to pronounce it in English, I just know how to pronounce it in German and I know that it comes from South Africa so I know how they say it there but this is a Fireberry Cranberry Hibiscus Rooibos Tea that is so cool all natural ingredients love that, can you see this? yes, now you can looks amazing very excited to try that okay if, am i going too fast i don't know this one's a honey and sons english breakfast tea and also i love a nice tin i love a good english breakfast okay let's keep going honey and sons gochi berry Ooh, i mean i put them in my cereal every day but i surely never had goji berry tea I want to know how they all smell, but I don't want to open them yet. I am so excited to try this. Goji berry. So cool. Okay, now this looks like a lot of fun. Oh, wow. <gasps> she, oh my God. She bought me a tea tin just because. She wants me to have this beautiful tea tin. Look at this. And in the back, this is so useful. I hope this shows on camera. There's... Oh, come on. Come on now. There's all the different kinds of tea listed and how you should boil them and how you should steep them, I guess, and enjoy them. Oh, nice. And then it says open me, so I guess there's something inside. Oh my god! Oh my god, I wish you could smell. Wow! Wow, okay. What have you... How long did it take you to make this parcel? I now understand why it's taken her a few weeks to make this. Wow! Did you write this? I'm sorry, I'm switching between second and, and third person. There are individual sachets of little samples of, I'm thinking, all the different Bluebird Tea Company teas that she has. Apple, elderflower, champagne. Wow. Kung, oh, Kung Flu Fighter. She just recently talked about this in a video. Why do I keep going back to third person? The cat's pajamas. I've heard about that one too. Totally, totally nutty. Oh my God, it smells so good. Dragon Pearl. These look so cool. This is from Horny and Sons again, so they're not all from Bluebird. Oh my God. Okay, hold on. There we go. Look, that's so beautiful. Mountain Air. Oh my god, I'm out of focus. This is the one that I she asked me. So we had a little backstory. We filled out... No, we were talking on Twitter for like a month or two before we started this project. And we sent each other like surveys basically where we were like, so what's your favorite color? So what's the country that you've never been to but always wanted to go to? Like... What kind of food do you eat that tea would go nicely with and stuff? So we've kind of like curated this collection of tea that we think would go great with the other person's life. And she asked me which tea from any of her videos I've always wanted to try and I said Mountain Air. So now she's included that. I'm so ready to try. I'm going to be just drinking tea for the rest of this month and nothing else. Okay, so the tin huge fan love all the different samples very very excited to have this in my kitchen and fill it with a beautiful delicious tea another honey and sons this is hot cinnamon spice so in this little sip spy bag she also i don't know why i took them all out sent me these super handy tea bags they're empty but that's the point they have like a little, even a little string and a tag on them. And you can just put your loose leaf in there. 
and enjoy it. This is gonna be, do you know what? I'm gonna take this traveling. Yes, because I'm actually, oh my God. Yes, I'm going to Cornwall. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Um, this June and July, I'm gonna go on a road trip and I'm gonna be living in Northern Ireland for almost a month because I'm teaching there as well. And so I was thinking this whole time, like, oh, I'm gonna have to buy tea there, which is fine. It's the, like the capital of tea, the whole, you know, area. But I wanna bring some tea along and I have a lot of loose tea at home, but then do I have to take my strainer and everything? So now I can just bring these little bags and use them when I travel. This is so cool. Thank you. Okay, let's move. There is a present in here. Okay, so that's looking very lovely. This feels like birthday and Christmas together. Wow. Wow, a tea scoop. Everyone needs a perfect teaspoon. And it says on the little handle, one cup of perfect tea. That is so cool. This beautiful tin, I'm just so spoiled. Wow. My favorite recommendation for tea newbies. Decaffeinated black tea with vanilla, wow. A light bodied black tea with naturally sweet aroma and taste. Oh, this sounds delicious, and the box is just so beautiful. And then, the little glorious bag of fun, which I see contains a lot of samples, and I'm very, very excited about that. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Ooh, there's a pomegranate oolong. That feels really interesting, but like there's whole pomegranate seeds in there. Organic green with citrus and ginkgo. Oh my god, the gingerbread chai! This is so cool. Let me look through them all quickly. Zest tea Earl Grey. Yes, green tea, strawberry and rhubarb. That sounds really, really cool. Earl Grey cream! Yes, I've always wanted to try the Bluebird Earl Grey cream. You probably didn't see that. Ooh, and I've been very intrigued to try some mushroom tea, so she sent me the shiitake turmeric one. Okay, so I think that's it. I think I'm gonna wrap it up, but I am so, so grateful and happy about this parcel. Like, Kathy, you do not understand how ready I am to dive into the world of tea and go crazy tomorrow morning and tonight. I'll have a cup of tonight. It's quite late, but I'll have one tonight. I don't care. Thank you so much for inviting me into your world of tea and showing me all of your favorites and giving me the perfect kit as well. Like, how cool is this? I am so, so happy about this. I really hope we do meet eventually so that we can have a cup of together and talk face to face. We need to make it happen. We've got to. Please subscribe to see maybe another video I'll do with these teas, with one of those teas. And definitely go and subscribe to Kathy and check out her video where she's unboxing my parcel. So thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.